What's up, everybody? Tom got back here again, again. Close your eyes. We're leaving this world and this reality, this life that we live behind. Yeah. I want you to close your eyes and think for a minute. Because this could happen. And I want to bring it to you while I'm here. So close your eyes. Think of the world that you live in. Think of all the wonderful things. How easy it is to get food. If you got the money, you can get anything you want, anytime you want. Now close your eyes. That world's gone. You open your eyes. Now here you are. In a world of uncertainty. In a world where there's no fast food. Grocery stores have been looted. People are hungry. People are going crazy. You escape that. You escape the concrete jungle. And here you are. You're hiding out. You're trying to get away from all the chaos. All the insanity. All the things in life. That while times were good. Oh, they were good. You were able to get whatever you wanted. It was the land of milk and honey. Everybody could get anything they wanted at any time if they had the dough. But the dough's no more, baby. Now this is your home. You're wandering. You're wandering in the woods. Trying to be quiet. You're trying not to get the attention of anybody. Because you don't know who's your friend and who's not anymore. Now you live in a world where anybody you talk to can either rob you for your supplies, they can beg off you, anything can happen. They could kill you. Just because you've got a backpack. Not even knowing what you've got in your backpack. So here you are. Out here where you never thought you'd be. You never thought it would be like this. You never thought the government would betray you like this. You never thought that... Life could be this way. You thought for the rest of your life, you were just going to live your life like you always did. Now open your eyes. Grocery stores are ransacked. Neighborhoods are battlegrounds. Cities are controlled by the gangs. Your life has meant less than zero. What you have is all you have. Who you're with is all you know. You don't want to start trusting people now. Here you are out in the woods. Every little sound sends shock waves down your spine. It's a different world. You don't know who to count on or who to trust anymore. You may be alone. You may have people with you. Either way, every encounter could be life or death. What do you do? Now you're worrying about wild animals. Wild people. People that will cut your throat just because they don't care about you your life means nothing now 
you're lost to the woods. You may have said that bugging out into the woods is a good idea. You can make it. Oh, you'll be just fine. Maybe you never spent time in the woods, but oh, you're gonna be okay. Wait till nightfall. When you hear the coyotes howling, you wait and you see for the snakes. You wait and see what's gonna happen. You get turned around, you don't know where you're at. You don't know who's friend or who's foe. You're alone or you're with a small group. And here you are. Maybe you've got no supplies or you're low supplies. So what are you gonna do? This is your life now. How are you gonna live it? What can you do? Well, friends, this could be a reality because you're not gonna wanna be in the cities. You're not gonna wanna be suppressed. You're not gonna wanna deal with all the things that city life entails that you deal with. So here you are, just like I am now. You're out here in the woods. You didn't study your terrain. You didn't study what plants, what bugs, what animals are out here. You thought that you were just gonna make it in the woods, that when things get bad, you were just gonna come out here and live off the land. No plans, you were just gonna live off the land, right? Till it gets dark. And there's hungry animals. And there's people that haven't eaten in a long time. They're delirious. If they catch you, you don't know what they're gonna do to you. You have no idea what your future is. Just close your eyes. Think about what's gonna happen. Are you really ready for such a world? Are you gonna stay in the city? What are your plans? Odds are you're gonna be looking for the first way to GTFO. I know I would. And I know where to go and what to do. But that's me. What about you? How are you gonna keep your way of life living back in the safe zone? That part of the story's over. Honestly, anybody that thinks they're just gonna book out to the woods or get out of the city has no plan, does not know the areas, does not know the threats. Well, you're a fool. Better check yourself, get real, get humble. No, you're not the highest on the food chain. You're prey out here, you're not predator. Some people will be predators, but they're gonna prey on you. Do you know what to do? That's my story to you. Tom Cab wants to make sure everybody's safe. Everybody doesn't think just jumping to the woods is the best idea. Look down. Look around. Do you see poisonous snakes? Do you see scorpions? Do you see anything that can hurt you, that can kill you, that can paralyze you? Now look down in the distance. Be still like a sniper and be quiet. You may be sitting for hours, days, 
waiting to see if it's safe to move. What are you going to do? Are you thinking that just because you're in the woods, you're safe? You're not safe. You're prey out here. I don't care if you're strapped up with the gats up. You're prey. You're being hunted. Especially if you don't know where you're going or what you're doing and you've got no supplies. You're the prey. So sit back and think about the world that's coming. That could happen. Oh my God, there's Mama Kitty. Mama! I ain't seen Mama Kitty in like three weeks. She's over here. She might be coming with me tonight. I'm throwing the illusion off. But you get the idea. I love you guys. Don't think you're going to bolt in the woods once this shit hits the fan. That might not be an option if you don't know what you're doing. I love you guys. Tom Cat out.